uh, as a parent myself of daughters, I want my daughters to be able to have exactly the same opportunities as everyone else to succeed, whether in Parliament or politics or uh, any other field that they may choose to go into. The long hours that, uh, that are required if you want to become uh, a Member of Parliament, and that's something that, that perhaps people need to think about. Uh, and it does make it very difficult for women of who have children of school age to go into politics if they're the prime carer of those children, which statistically they very often are. I mean, make no comment as to whether that's good or bad, but that's the reality. Uh, but there are a lot of wider issues as well that I think you know women need that need tackling on behalf of women, and particularly things like forced marriage, female genital mutilation, uh, just the attitudes, sexist, backward, cultural attitudes that are displayed towards women when they may walk around. Uh, the streets. There's a lot that needs doing, and, and, um, and women are the best place to bring forward legislation to deal with that. I'm interested in what's happened in the Welsh Assembly in the Scottish Parliament, where, where it virtually is a reality, and that suggests to me it's not so much the attitude of the public that's a problem, it's, uh, it, it's practical difficulties around the, uh, the pattern of working that makes it harder statistically for some women to get into Parliament.